You could have a spacecraft going out near the speed of light and we on Earth would watch its clock and its clock would be ticking off time so slowly that to the person on the ship they would be able to go much further than we would think they would be able to if we didn't take that into account. Right. Okay. So, so you know, we could send you know some intrepid voyager out into space, and they could go and near the speed of light. Near the speed of light, and they could go arbitrarily far in their lifetime. In their lifetime. Yes. So then they come back home, and everyone would have forgotten about them because hundreds of thousands of years would have passed, or millions or billions of years. It was absolutely right. 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 Wow. So that's not that's not what people are imagining when they're thinking of space travel. No. Yeah. I mean, so. But, but, but it really matters, you know, if we were to take, you know, a group of our species and send them out into space, it mm -hmm. really would be within their lifetime that they'd be able to, according to the laws of physics, go arbitrarily far. Right. And In so the, right. it's kind of. It's, now, you're right, the people back on Earth, they perhaps would be long extinct, okay. you know.